My personal medical hero is Dr. Centurio, the father of population-based quantitative medicine, pioneer in the field of biometrics, game-changing innovator of new medical technology. Now, if you've never heard of Dr. Centurio, perhaps it's because he lived over 400 years ago. He was a chair of theoretical medicine at the University of Padua, and he was the very first physician to measure body temperature, pulse rate, and determine the population-based averages for those metrics. You may not know his name, but you certainly know his numbers. 98.6, 120 over 80, 72 beats per minute. Prior to Dr. Centario, medicine was strictly qualitative, practiced by a physician asking, how do you feel? Where does it hurt? Today, we can collect continuous biometrics from sensors on our body, in our body, and watching everything that we do. Dr. Centario forever transformed medicine with his quantitative approach. Today, we're on the verge of the next transformation. Quantitative Medicine 2.0, where we will be able to detect a slight change in someone's health before there's even, even any symptoms. Let me explain. Today, meteorologists combine satellite images with data collected from all sorts of sensors, run them through sophisticated computer programs, to predict the perfect storm. Soon, doctors will be able to combine heart rate, respiration rate, and other biometrics to, to determine when someone is uh, getting sick. Now, much like the meteorologist, when you combine all the biometric data together, holistically, you get a much brighter and clearer picture of what is happening, rather than looking at it in isolation. Proven uh, machine learning technologies can now detect the subtle but meaningful changes in the complex patterns of human physiology in order to predict uh, an adverse medical event before it occurs. We're throwing out population-based metrics and instead developing personalized baselines that, that quantify your unique physiology. The reason we're doing that is because we want to compare you to you to see those subtle changes that are most meaningful to you and your physician. One of the most compelling examples in the clinical space is congestive heart failure. A growing body of data shows that this approach predicts when a CHF patient is headed into that perfect storm of cardiac pulmonary catastrophe. That's one example of many for this new approach in medicine. 400 years ago, when Dr. Centurio was practicing medicine, a ship's captain headed into a hurricane had but just a few hours of advance notice. By that time, his fate was sealed. Today, thanks to the continuous collection of meteorological data, data, that captain knows days in advance so he can navigate out of harm's way. That's exactly what we need to do in medicine and health and fitness. And we're on it. Looks like rain. Thank you.